Hello my sweet friends, how are you doing? As you can see my face looks a little bit weird this time. Why? Because we're gonna make another face deformation tutorial. Pizza face. So, to start, just go in my recent video of face deformation. I'm gonna link you up here and download the free template <coughs> you have there. Why? You can open the face deformation template, but then you won't have something that I'm gonna show you in a second. So, just open my template and download it. You're gonna see why. It's gonna be something like this, maybe something different with big forehead or triangle. I don't know the way I left it, but for sure it's just like this with the face distortion pack uploaded, which is what we're gonna use. So, we have the project working and uh, we're gonna go real fast and grab something from the internet which is gonna be of course a pizza now i have already downloaded you can go and remove the background on photoshop on your favorite tool but to be fast this time i just want to use this pizza i've just downloaded with it, which is a fake png it comes with this checkerboard behind and then remove background all right download now we should have a real yeah, as you can see no checkerboard and this is real transparent png and uh, so let's go on assets and uh, import from computer it's in download so let's just go like that and here we have it let's turn it in our compression how funny is that i'm doing the whole tutorial with this face i think it's funny but so we have our face tracker and face mesh and we're gonna call it distortion and now i want to duplicate it this duplicate it so we have two now but I want, uh, instead of the face wrap material, I'm going to create a new material. So now we have, as you can see, the face mesh without our face. And it's being distorted the same way. Why? Because we have the face distortion pack here in a morph object. If you will just open the face deformation template, you won't have this file. And you're gonna find all of this in the form of blocks or something. I just try it, so. And uh, so now that we're here, we can just check eyes and mouth. So we have kind of a something going on. And then you can click somewhere on the face. Wrap material, I guess. okay this is it i don't quite like the kind of line on her mouth but we'll see and so with the material one <clears throat> we're gonna call it pizza <clears throat> <clears throat> let's leave it standard because i want a little light going on to kind of make some oily thing and now we have this, of course it doesn't really look like a pizza, so we go back on distortion and uh, let's turn off the pizza for a second and go back on distortion and we need you know, big face like a pizza, so let's try stretch and stretch vertical so maybe squash yeah squash there you have it put squash to like 150 now i look like south park but maybe a hundred kind of a pizza and then go on the pizza distortion call it pizza this something like that and turn 100 on a squash as well and you can turn it on again now you can see it start looking like a pizza a little bit. Still, maybe I want to 
some drop or maybe some stretch yeah just a little bit like that maybe a little more yeah there it is it looks kind of a pizza triangle nope a little little square over here just like eight stretch a hundred so let's do the same thing on the other one some eight on the square so we we have the same distortion under the pizza which is gonna help the whole effect <laughs> to like come together and uh, yeah i think we had scale and we're kind of there but we can still play around with it if we want maybe a little chin yeah a little chin okay like 52 on the chin so 52 on the chain you can just do one and then duplicate it at the end but this time it's gone like this and, uh, no no nose oh you also want to go on the distortion and check the eyes and mouth that's why it was kind of weird but so now we have eyes just big as regular eyes but if you uncheck it maybe i like it better this way also on the mouth yeah but there should be a way to get rid of those lines probably going in project edit properties quality maximum resolution maximum automatic something has changed okay capabilities face tracking accuracy high okay looks kind of cool now the last thing we want to do is take this directional light and kind of bring it the z-axis a little bit closer to the face okay give it like kind of a yellow oily thing so a yellow kind of a yellow greeny i guess not too much but just until it looks kind of oily we can take the ambient light and turn it up a little and then we can take the, this, the directional light and go on actions up on the right corner and just give it spin something like that turn up the ambient light a little bit more and maybe turn down a little bit this light and it's kind of kind of going to an oven uh, whatever the you make the pizza inside to cook it it's oven uh, I can't I can't speak English this morning but guys I hope you like it because this is the pizza phase just do it see how fun it. and if you think this is fun this helped you and I'm funny then you should subscribe and press like on this video right now and I will love you because you're loving me all right now it's time to go see you in the next one